I'm very neurotic. Like I get in my own head. Like, yeah. like, like when you came here, I'm like, is this too feminine? Like, like you know what yeah, I mean? Yeah, yeah, like, yeah. Like I'm yeah, very yeah. like always worried about things. I'm a very neurotic person, and um, I remember realizing once um, that you would think like if you're the type of person who worries about other things, you would think that you're like a sensitive person, like you're mm-hmm. compassionate. But it, I finally realized it's actually very narcissistic to worry what other people are thinking because, because it's you like think you're so important. because you because you think you're so important. You're that like, makes perfect sense. You're like you're like they're mad at me. Are they mad at me? It's like you're not that important to them, yeah. honey. Like, yeah, they, like, you're, like <laughs> they got a, they got rent to pay. Yeah, they got food to eat. They got a schedule to keep. They yeah. their boyfriend or girlfriend may have just dumped yeah. them. They may have just found out they got someone pregnant. They might find out their grandma was sick, and you think it's about you. Yeah, like you might trick yourself to thinking you're this caring person, yeah. but it's like you're actually very selfish. Like everybody is in their own world yeah. doing their own thing people are walking past you on the street not giving a fuck who you are yeah. they have no idea to worry what you're wearing what you smell like yeah. what you look like who you're standing next to and here you are thinking that they give a fuck yeah i, I like, know, like I, I, it dawned on me one day you. i was like wow i'm actually a very selfish person like yeah. i think everybody cares that's a really, about me. That's like, a really no interesting way to put it <laughs> it's like you think everyone's yeah, everybody in here is thinking what you're doing yeah well, the fuck they're not that because we and i guess as you get older you realize we got we all got our own fucking problems yeah which i think is what what i like about comedy because comedy Comedians have a way of like oversharing sometimes, but oh it's gosh, like, yeah. um, I think for me it is like a coping a coping mechanism with that neurotic side of me that's always like, what is this person to say? What is it? So for me, it's like kind of soothing just to like, like vomit all my flaws out to the world, like yeah. just be like, this, I, I'm this piece of shit. Like you know what well, I mean? Well, doesn't like, your humor lie in that? Yeah. Right. I, I feel like you. I, I think it's very good to be vulnerable. Yeah. And you know, especially if you're trying to build a relationship with the person, yeah. right? Like if if I if I you if I you and I really wanted to have a good relationship, yeah. one of the best things I could do is tell you something that opens me up a little bit, right? Yeah. And I think because that's that's when you're you're at your yeah. realist, you know what I mean? Like yeah. when the guard is down. And I think it within that is so much humor with like the self dialogue you have and and yeah. what you think people think about you and and what that says about what maybe you think about other people and yeah. when you're high when you're low and your weakest points and that there's a lot of humor in that you yeah. know what I mean so I think that that's good I think it's good and I think that's yeah. why people do that is because if you try to do it from this fake voice it's fake yeah it's just fake yeah you know if you do it from this authentic voice people can feel like the highs and the lows and the laughter in it. 